Hey there, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so, um, I was cleaning up my room last weekend, um, like trying to tidy up and reorganize and trying to, trying to refine it a little more, because, you know. Anyway, I found a product that was sent to me for review from the Born Pretty store that I totally forgot that I had. It was in my basket. So when I get new products or whatever, or new items, it's, I keep them on my desk beside me and I have a basket that I kind of throw things in. Yeah, it, it, it had gotten a little out of hand and I hadn't, um, yeah, totally forgot it. So I decided I'm going to play. And of course, I can't get it open. So what it is, I don't know if there's a tabby thing. So that's like the order sticker on it. Um, and what they are, what this one is, is a watercolor nail painting pen. Um, and they come in, so what I did was I printed off from the website. So it comes in a variety of different colors. Um, I believe, um, so I got HI11, which I believe, uh, I can't remember where, I can't read it. So it's newly something or other. So I'll look it up, I believe it's the black one. Because I wanted to see how it worked. Put the thingy back on so I don't stab myself. So, come on. So, and I printed off the uh, directions. So they have printed directions, but then I realized. Open the box, remove empty pen and cartridge, contains product, remove the cap and rotate to disassemble the pen. Pull the cartridge, plug the cartridge into the pen carefully or plug the cartridge into the pen until the steel ball falls down in the cartridge and the ink will be transferred to the tip of the pen. Reassemble the pen and push the head of the pen the watercolor will transfer to the tip of the pen and then use the pen over your gel polish. And then it's got reminder or warnings. So I printed off the directions. I'll take a picture and or screenshot off their website and then you can you can see. So contains product. So the pen and the cartridge. So, contains product, whoops, remove the, remove the cap and rotate to disassemble. Okay, so remove the cap. Oh, so that's that part. Oh, see, I've messed up the freaking thing already. There it is. <laughs> Duh. Okay. So plug the cartridge. So I'm assuming it goes like that. Plug the cartridge carefully into the pen or plug the cartridge into the pen until the steel ball falls down into the cartridge. So that's together. Reassemble. Oh, reassemble. Do you think that's together? Okay. And then twist it back. Oh, look, the ink is coming out already. But I'm a little choked that I messed up that. Let's just do this. We're gonna those babies off. 
Okay. So what I've done is, oops, I'll stop myself. I've prepared some nail tips. Get this baby out. So regular polish and gel polish. So I did a couple of each so um, we can play. Because I wanted to see, so with the regular polish, normally when I'm using alcohol inks, I, um, I leave them shiny. I don't matte them, but with gel polish, I matte them. So. Oh, very handy. So, and I'm just using like long tips just because that's what I had. Let's see if we get some acetone. And doo -doo -doo, a brush. We can kind of marble it. Or not acetone, alcohol. So I got some alcohol, I got an old brush. I ain't got a paper towel. So let's play. Make some. Make some marble nails. This is easy. So. Oh, I just realized it's got a different color out, um, from last time. I didn't clean the brush. It's, uh, look, it's brown. So it didn't affect it too much. So it works well on, let's get another brush and I'll make sure I clean it the next time. Let's try this one. This one should be. So let's try it on my gel. And I'm gonna get a new clean face paper towel. So they say that so it's kind of cool. They've got a bunch of different colors. So they got a blue, a pink, red, purple, yellow, green, and then you can do um, like designs and then as well as marbling. So it gives you a lot of, of options. So. And one nice thing, it's hard sometimes, so for me, I don't know um, about you, but I like it to be symmetrical. <laughs> so, see, it doesn't move as well. See, that's why I don't like matting it. So let's glossy top coat the other gel. see if that makes a difference because right now so I just throw this into the lamp okay. so right now it's it's soaked into the gel polish so it's not really um, letting me I uh, see I used this one too before so it's not spreading like the other one so I don't like that one okay so don't do matte so because it definitely spreads Nicely. So it 
definitely. It does the nice marble look. And you can just totally play with it until you like it. take more of the product off so these are a little bit easier to work with versus um, um, what am I trying to say the bottles okay so this is okay so this is glossy now and it's I used a no wipe so It doesn't spread like that. I like it better on the regular polish, to be totally honest. Or maybe you need to wet it first. Bad. But yeah, it kind of gives you more of a 3D kind of look when it's wet. So what do you think? Not bad. So I just want to get this one totally wet. See if I can I just kind of push the button now. So definitely don't do matte um, because it um, it doesn't I should can do 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 I'm gonna color the whole thing because I don't like it anyway. something interesting. <laughs> I'm not sure it does look too bad now, now that I've made it darker. Go down the edges. So um, gives it kind of a neat touch texture. So let's I got one more. Let's play with one more and then, then we'll call it a day. <laughs> so let's do Just gonna go in and taking some of the alcohol out. Kind of like that. Let's do up here and then a little in there. 
So there's no rhyme or reason to your little design. You can do as much of this as you want or as little as you want. You can just play with it like you can play for hours with this stuff so I'm kind of sad now I need more colors these are they're actually kind of fun so we can totally jazz these up too like you can um, you can add um, gold leaf to them and um, yeah do a total nail design so I totally like him on regular polish um, way better than I mean this one wasn't bad so I mean I'm sure if I take a little bit more but personally I kind of like the regular polish so versus gel It, um, it seems to go better. Oh. Oh, but it's not bad. But, um, maybe you have to do a little bit and then play, a little bit and then play, but yeah. So I'll put the lid back on so it doesn't dry out. But yeah, these are these are totally fun. Um, yeah, I like that it comes in a, a brush and so it's easy to dispense. It wasn't as hard to put together that I thought it would be. I thought it would be a lot harder looking at the instructions, but um, yeah, I, I like it. So there you have it. This is a Born Pretty water nail painting pen and um, yeah. Thank you to Born Pretty for sending this to me. I appreciate it. It was fun to try out. Now I gotta go look for more colors because I think it'd be fun to do some different different designs. But the black one is a definite if you wanna do marble. So, cause the marble's fun. <laughs> okay, um, so thanks for hanging out with me while I play. I hope you guys are doing well and staying safe and um, yeah if you're new here don't forget to hit that bell um, hit subscribe and hit that bell so you know when I upload next and yeah love you guys remember be someone sparkle